You have 17 messages. Hey there, kiddo. It's, uh, it's your dad. <laughs> yeah, I realize it's, uh, it's been a while. But, uh, I just, I just figured it's, uh, maybe I'd check in. I haven't heard from you in a bit, so thought maybe something might be wrong. Me and your mom are a little, a little bit scared, to be honest, but I'm sure you're doing just fine. That's what I tell her every day. I say, don't you worry. That right there is the smartest kid I ever raised. <laughs> don't tell your sister, so. Uh, li listen, I, I know you're busy uh, with your, you know, study and got that amazing job. I just, I just want you to know, we're doing all right, you know. You don't have to worry about us. Uh, but we, we're, we're thinking of you, and, and we're real proud. College. Never thought I'd have one of you go to college, but well, look at you go. <laughs> Here I go, getting all emotional. <sighs> No tears, Clarence. Your mom wanted to be here on the phone as well, but... Well, you know how she is. Always busy. Running the diner. Working herself to the bone. But, uh... <laughs> well, I guess that's why you're so hard working yourself. Got that from your mom, that's for sure. I always try to do my best. You know, I uh, tried to be there for you as much as I could, but, well, I realized that I wasn't always there when you needed me. And, to be honest, it's, it's something I've been thinking about for a while. I, I hope you know that all those times I couldn't be there for you, and, couldn't take you to your baseball games and go to those parent-teacher meetings. I hope you realize that I had things to do that, that if I could have done anything else, I definitely would have picked you. I just hope you know that. And, uh, well, uh, I heard about that new partner of yours, and, uh, we're thinking, uh, may maybe it's time we start being better parents. You know, it's better late than never, right? I'm, uh, I'm real, I'm real keen to meet him. And, uh, um, well, I know it's only usually a family thing, but, oh, heck, why don't you invite him to Christmas? All right, all right, maybe that's a bit too far. But, uh, I mean, at least Thanksgiving. No, that's too much. Grandma would never let that happen. Well, I want him, I want to meet him, is what I'm saying. And, well, I, I want to be, and I know that maybe because of my absences, I don't deserve it, but, I want to be a bigger part of your life. I want to be there for you. I want to... Honestly, I just want to know you better. I feel like years gone by, you've been out studying, traveling, working. I don't know who you are anymore. That worries me. I'm trying real hard. I'm trying real hard. To just understand and learn, and, and keep up with you kids, and uh, I haven't been doing a real good job of it, but damn if I am doing my best, and uh, I know I was tough on you growing up, but, well, I love you, and uh, it's hard for me to say that to anyone, you know that? But I do, and uh, 
think it's important you know that. Look, all I'm saying is, you're special to me. You mean the world to me. And your sisters, don't worry. But I just want you to know that so incredibly proud. So, so happy. Just, whenever we hear something that you've done or any study that you've been, you know, getting good grades and all that work you've been doing, I mean, now that you got a partner as well, I mean, oh heck, can't get emotional again. I'm just saying, whenever I see your ma read something that you send in the emails or, you know, when she gets a phone call from you, whenever your ma gets a phone call from you or, or an email, well, it's about the gosh darn best thing I ever did see in my life. Makes me the happiest man I could ever be. And the only way I could ever be happier is if, uh, well, maybe I, maybe I could get some of those phone calls. <laughs> I know that things have been tough, but hell, maybe I'll call you. <laughs> Listen, kiddo, uh, I, I just, you know I'm not good with words, never have been, doesn't look like I'm going to start anytime soon, but it doesn't mean I don't love you, and it doesn't mean I'm not proud, I just have some trouble saying it, that's all, and, uh, well, I'm doing, I'm doing my best to make sure you, you, you get that. And, uh, well, to be perfectly honest, I miss you. I miss you so much. And, uh, well, it would mean a lot to your ma if you come bring that new partner of yours over. It doesn't, ha doesn't have to be for the whole day. Uh, we can just do uh, lunch or something. I know you're busy, but, um... Wow, it, it made a hell of a lot. Anyway, I uh, I know it's pretty late, so um, sorry if this uh, this answering machine message wakes you up. But well, uh, I, I bet I better go. I better let you sleep. Uh, I love you, kiddo. Hope I see you soon. Good night. I guess that's uh, where you get your tenacity from. Tenacity. <laughs> Look, the sirens are coming. I don't have much time left. There's about two mil stashed under the floorboards in the old farmhouse. You know what I'm saying? Picking up what I'm putting down. All right, look, Pa Bird's about to fly the jail cell real soon. Don't you worry. All right. <laughs> wow, these sirens are getting real close. <laughs> wow, now there's two of them. Listen, all right, I ain't got much time. The police are finally getting to me. Found my snake farm, but don't worry, Pa slippery like that. I'll be out of here in no time. <laughs> All right, the siren's gone. <laughs> Seeing her face light up is just about the best darn thing I ever did see in my life. Ever did see in my life? <clears throat> Got that hard working in you. What the fuck am I talking about? It's time for a very heartfelt thank you to this month's patrons. As always, starting off the list, we have Tanaka Tepes, Jennifer Smith, Aries, I'm still not sure if that's the correct way to say that, <laughs> and 
a new patron this month, Hannah Rothman. Thank you for joining, Hannah. And Baby Dragon, Laika, Charlie Decker, and Rosie. Thank you all so much for supporting me on Patreon. I really appreciate it, and I don't have the words to properly explain it, as you guys well know. But thank you. Thank you very, very much. You guys mean the world to me. Okay. Bye.